Right. You know, one of these days, I'm going to come back to this. I'm going to be like, wow, I remember exactly what we were going to do. I remember everything. And I don't feel like I need to play for like half an hour before I'm back into the swing of things. <laughs> Today is not that day. It has been a couple days since we last, or since I last played. Um, oh, right. I'm slowly starting to remember what's around here. Yes. Because why have one Black Knight when you can have two Black Knights? Uh, if we could just attract the attention of one of them, that would be fantastic. I also do not see the other one. But I'll take it. Okay. And now we run away. This is only... Oh, dear. I got stuck in a uh, tree and I almost fell off the edge. Okay, well, this is probably a good enemy to start us back into getting this back. Blah, blah, blah. This is probably a good enemy to get us back into the swing of things, is what I'm trying to say. Oh no. Man, this guy is way easier than Champion Gundir. <laughs> way easier. Man, I had so much time between each swing. It's fantastic. Oh, I wonder why this guy didn't come after us. Hello. Yes, yes. I mean, these guys aren't even as bad as the uh, 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 Cathedral Knights. Like, the Cathedral Knights are horrible. Man, I got so used to fighting Champion Gundy. These guys are like, oh, why? Why do I? Why do I brag? Why do I brag? Oh, we were too far away. Man, they... <laughs> They're like moving in slow motion at this point. Oh, I thought he was going to, yeah, do that. Man. Okay. Well, that did not go nearly as badly as I was expecting it to. <clears throat> I think those are the two main ones. I can't remember there being any more, but then I don't... I don't think I've gotten to this part of the game more than twice. There are many theories about... I mean, I suppose that you could say that of anything in Dark Souls, but as I recall, there are many theories about this particular section of Dark Souls. Ah, there is another. There is another which we will be running away from because fighting them on the edge is just the absolute worst idea. Okay, he's still coming after us. Just need to get him down, 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 here. Okay, I can see why locking on... Ow. I can see why locking on can be detrimental. Uh, simply because we keep dodging the wrong direction. But I think... Um, I think I'm okay. Uh, we keep dodging the wrong direction, and that may be why... Ugh, should not have been greedy. I like how we're just dealing with the uh, Silver Knights, Black Knights, I don't remember. I like how we're just dealing with them, no problem now. What was I saying? Right, because I'm kind of used to using a shield, um, the dodging isn't a, isn't as big of an issue when locked on. Hornet ring. I don't get that, to be perfectly honest. Okay, um, isn't that the one that lets you shoot for it farther, or is that the hawk ring? Um, hornet ring, hornet ring. Why did I do it this way? Why did I do it this way? Hornet ring. Um is in here somewhere. There we go. Boosts criticals. Hmm. I see. So in other words, that's the one that all of the the um, uh, invaders are going to be using. Ah, yes. There are many theories about why this place exists. <sighs> Seriously? Oh, boy. And now we have literally no use for 
uh, Homeward Bones ever again. Because this is just infinite uses of a Homeward Bone. I'm tempted to even put it on our... In fact, I might. In fact, I might put it in our quick items. I mean, we don't ever use it, to be fair. What? Well, fancy that. A lost lamb wandereth in with nary a peep from the bell. Well, thou shouldst my purpose know. What can this... What do you sell? Wolf Knight? Oh, very cool, very cool. Uh... <laughs> Sorry, I just read that and interpreted it a little, little, little literally, which is kind of amusing. Yeah, yeah. That is so much. Best so, the implication is that we have gone back in time, or possibly forward in time, although it doesn't make sense that we would have gone backward in time, because, or sorry, forward in time, because if we'd gone forward in time, wouldn't the hand uh, shrine maiden know who we were, um, or that we are in a parallel reality, that this is one of the many realities, uh, where, oh, that's where we get those? Interesting. I didn't realize that. Um, or a parallel reality, as in one of the realities from which you summon phantoms, um, which does make a degree of sense, I think. Actually, no, it, it, it makes the most sense uh, that we are in a parallel reality here. How we got here? Just by walking down the hallway? Dunno. That is one disadvantage here and advantage, because you can just, like, walk in a direction and then find yourself in a brand new place that you had, or a brand new place that looks strangely familiar, but there's no, like, wavery walls no, uh, no craziness like that. But then again, you don't really need it. Oh, I wanted to read this. Okay. Is there anything else here? Um, I don't think so. I think we're pretty much good on the inside. So let's, uh, check all of the exterior, I guess. I feel so bad. We've, we've messed up the, uh, NPC plot lines so badly. So incredibly badly. Like, Sigurd died... And, um, I'm pretty sure Grey Rat died, and no luck there. Now, that's interesting. I wonder, I mean, clearly somebody got up there. I wonder if there's anything up there, though. Almost certainly not, since this door doesn't exist. But it is tempting to try, you know? It is so tempting to try. And I'm so f infrequently here. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pause the episode. I'm going to try to uh, get on top of the roof using kind of the cheat. And then we'll go around and explore. Now, I don't expect there to be anything up there, but I want to try anyway. Or, you know, I'll get it on the very first try and there was no reason for me for me to pause the episode. Well then. <laughs> Seriously, I, I did that on the first try. I was not expecting that to go quite so well. Uh, iron, yes, and we are at 64.5%, everything is looking good. There's not going to be anything up here. Gotta try everything, though. I mean, I don't think they were... Oh, hmm. I wasn't expecting that. Fascinating. No pickle pea, of course, and I doubt there's a... Oh, it's just open, interesting. Interesting, interesting. Is there anything over here? Uh, no, of course not. Well then, that was a little disappointing. Oh, there's an open chest. Now that's very interesting. So had we not opened the chest in our Firelink, would this chest be open? I'm not sure. This is, this is interesting information. Why is there an open chest here? That's very, very strange. Nevertheless, uh, we got up there. There was nothing interesting. So we shall be leaving then. I don't think there's anything else. Uh, we haven't been up uh, this way, that's right. Need to make sure we aren't forgetting anything. I would not be surprised. Yes, there's almost certainly a Black Knight or Silver Knight up here. Ah, there's a Silver Knight right there. Let us retreat a little bit back to a slightly more open area. 
get him to follow us. Uh, yeah, this is probably fine. Ah. Oh, that is a much, a much longer reach than I think it has. Ah. Every time. How does he get it every time? Probably because he anticipates me doing exactly what I did. Or am doing, I suppose. It's interesting that he was above us. I wonder if that means... Hmm. Perhaps there isn't anybody... Up there. I mean, I would expect there to be. Oh, and I just remember what, what item that is. Very exciting. Very exciting indeed. So that's worth 10,000 souls, right? That's that's not bad either. Nothing of interest over here, I don't think. Uh, no, nothing of interest over here. <coughs> <laughs> Can't believe I... You know, the first time I tried jumping that uh, gap, I'm pretty sure I, I gave it like 40 or 50 tries before I got it. And then this time, just first try... Yes, the Chaos Blade. Not quite tempting enough to use, but as I recall, uh, the Chaos Blade is... Oh, it is different than the Black Blade. I didn't realize that. So, yes, attacks also damage its wielder. Interesting. Interesting. So what is the benefit to the Black Blade over the Uchigatana? Or is it just different? I guess it's got better guard absorption if you wanted that. It weighs more and it does less damage. That is very strange. We will have to check that again once we get up to 18 strength. But otherwise, we have found everything that we came here for. I believe we will be handing in those eyes of the Firekeeper. We'll be heading for that ending, if I remember how to do it correctly. I've always been a fan of extinguishing the flame, since I I see it as unnatural. Well, I mean, I suppose everything's unnatural, but uh, I suppose in, reali in, in my reality, uh, I would probably be more along the lines of Gwyn than anybody else. Okay, have we done everything over here? We've done all that. Uh, we have gone, uh, where did we start from? Oh boy, where did we start from? Uh, so to get to the Untended Graves, we went past... Um... Some place. Some place indeed. Ah, here we go, Osiris, there we go. So we went past Osiris, don't really care about the rest of them, so I think we're just gonna go back to the Dancer, yeah? I wonder how this game would have differed had they gone with the Demon's Souls philosophy of bonfires next to every boss. Or bonfires every time you defeat a boss. I think I think the whole game is a little too big for that to work effectively, but it would be interesting. Yeah, it's, it's probably too much of a run between bosses for that to really work, but... They just need to add more bosses, obviously. Okay, uh, that is that direction done, I think. And once again, I have forgotten that we wanted to... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Did we ever pick up a mendicant's staff? I thought that's where... I thought that, I thought that was this way. Maybe it's not. Oh boy, the first like half hour of this episode is just going to be wandering around, not really remembering what I'm supposed to be doing. Let's, uh, let's get to the next... Ow. Let's get to the next bonfire. My goodness. I don't really remember what's this way. Ugh. These guys are so aggressive. 
Ah. Oh. Needed one more hit. Didn't expect that. Okay. Now, this section is particularly troublesome. I recall needing to get rid of this guy pretty quickly. And then we have to deal with this guy who we would like to tease out if we could. I'd like him to come this way a little further, just because there is another one up there. Yeah. Fighting him in this room, as I recall, is is quite nice. Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, I guess we do not get that luxury. Rather, we do get to fight him here, but I'm very concerned that the other knight is going to be following us. I'm sorry, did that go through our defenses? I feel like that actually hurt us. Ugh, oh, I dodged that. Oh, ow. Okay, that is, that is too much. Ow. I remember why I don't like these guys. Because the moment you actually need to do something, other than fight them, it's a pain. I suppose that's why they're at the end of the game. Nice. Ha! <laughs> Ugh. First time I got here was not a fun day. As I recall, the next, uh, the next bonfire is not too far away from us, so, in fact, I'm pretty sure it's that room. So, let's just make sure we got everything here. Which I believe we have. So yeah, we went from a bonfire down there to a bonfire right here. They, uh, <laughs> they go a little overboard with the bonfires in this part of the game. Okay, we now have a choice. Um, we could go do the... DLC, which I keep forgetting to do, or we can go do the hidden area. I don't know. Let's do the hidden area. I mean, the, the problem with doing the hidden area is that there's a boss there that I don't remember if I've ever beaten, and I'm pretty sure we're going to, like, die 5,000 different times. It's just not, not a pretty day, not a pretty sight. Plus, I have to remember how to get through here now. Feels like so long ago, you know? I know this is the wrong elevator, but, um... Yeah, this is the wrong elevator. So, how do we get to that other elevator? I think we have to go, like... The map has already been purged from my mind. We need to go across the way... And then down a level, I think? Maybe? We'll find out. We'll have a pretty... Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a... Um, three hits, nice. Aristocrat. Interesting, interesting. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a bonfire pretty quickly afterwards, or at least nothing... There's a bonfire nearby enough that we don't need to worry too much about... Um, we don't need to worry about, uh... Oh, hello. Uh, so we don't want to go that way. We don't want to go that way. I was waiting for our health to come back so that when this one did it to us, we wouldn't have to waste an Estus. Uh, realizing that it takes a bit of extra time, but... Do we want to go that way? No, we don't want to go that way, so we must go down a level. I hope we're on the right side. Nice. So far, so good. Ugh, that is so frustrating. And yeah, there they, there they go. There they go. No fun. No fun whatsoever. Just so we are clear. Oh no. Oh no. Oh boy. Ugh. I hate this. I hate this. I just... I just want to fight... 
straightforwardly. Like seriously, we haven't even gotten hit and we have no health. Zero health. How have we never opened up this, uh, yeah, why have we never opened that up? Interesting. Oh my goodness. I knew that was a risk. I did not think it would be that much of a risk. Oh, that is frustrating. <sighs> we haven't even gotten hit. We have, we weren't even nearby. It's the two of them at once that's, well, three of them, technically. Uh, it's having th two of them attack you at once that's just so difficult to work with. Oops. Grab that. <laughs> just look how fast our health disappears. It's just, it's there one second and then completely gone the next. Yep, this is just turning into uh, me complaining about uh, the aristocrat jailers again. Sorry about that. Okay, that was supposed to be a plunging attack. It did not turn out the, w the way I was hoping. Why are we having so much trouble with these guys? Okay, there we go. Still frustrating, but dual. What? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I was not paying attention to our health. Because, you know, we weren't being hit or anything. Okay. You know, it's times like these that I'm really tempted to just run past all the enemies. Because I really stop caring. It's like, we've already beaten this area, we got used to the enemies, and then we just have to come back for one thing. Ah, uh, well, I'm complaining far too much. You know, if this enemy ever starts out with the different attack, I, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> if they start out with that, uh, uh, soldering iron attack, I don't know, uh, yeah, I don't know. Well, we keep increasing by 2,000 souls every time we come past here, so there's that at least. Okay. I definitely hit the plunging attack, like, twice. Yeah, I think staying down here is our only real hope, because we have to... We have to deal with them quickly. And even so, we, uh, we don't really have a whole lot of health left. Wow, we're doing a ton of damage to these guys now. Now, was it this way? Or was it... It must be this way, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this way. Oh, hang on a second. Sorry, I thought I saw an item over there. I was just a pot. Okay. Well, that was quite enough. Oh, that's not what I meant. Um... Um... Yes, that one. That is what the... Why did, that is the item we need. So... I have no idea how anyone ever found this. Like, how would you even think to do this? Like, yeah, sure, that enemy is, or that whatever he is, is uh, sitting like a dragon. But how would you think to do this? It's it's almost as, as ridiculous as going back to the um, Undead Asylum in Dark Souls. Like, how do you even think to do this? But you do. Now I'm hoping I'm not misremembering how, uh, or where the next bonfire is. Okay. It's also interesting that we spawn here, but we never, like, wake up back where we just were. As I recall, like, we just find a, uh... Or we just found a bonfire on this side and warp back. 
Okay, I have very little memory of this area. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. You know, we might need to come back here later. <laughs> I guess that's not so bad. I'm just used to being ridiculously overpowered, and here we're not overpowered. We're just kind of at at the appropriate level. Perhaps a little ahead. It's also impossible to see items around here. We got the item down there, right? Uh, yes, we got the item down there. And I'm not seeing everything o anything over here. I really like this area. It's It's amusing that it was just sort of a secret area that you have to know exists before you even have a chance of finding it. Um... But it's a cool area, and the boss is kind of interesting as well. <laughs> well. That's fascinating. Oh boy. Running, running, running. Okay, we would like to get past this, just so they stop shooting fireballs at us. Not so bad, not so bad. I was really hoping that would hit both of them. That dodge was poorly... Oh boy. There we go. That could have gone much better, but it also could have gone much worse. I forgot. I believe this is one of the uh, areas where they brought back the, um, oh, right, their fireballs curve. I forgot about that. Okay, I would like to attract the attention of this one. Okay. And then hide over behind this rock. Okay, just wait for our health to come back a bit. There we go. Or sorry, stamina to come back a bit. And now we can go for this one. And four hits, right? Yeah. So, the first time I found this place, or the first time I arrived here, um, and I don't really remember how I found it. I, I must have looked it up. Like, there's no way I would have found it normally. But, um... Um, sorry, just paying attention to the stuff. You know, that bell is still ringing. I thought it was the same as in Dark Souls, where you, uh, ring the bell, and other people in other worlds can hear you ring the bell, but I may be incorrect about that. Okay, we will need to proceed with caution. We may also want to come back here later. These are Titanite chunks, aren't they? Do we need chunks, or do we need slabs? Or no, we don't need slabs, obviously, but... Is it Titanite chunks that we need? I just don't remember. Okay, we have not attracted the attention of anything else, right? So we can deal with this guy alone? Not that I want to. Ooh, we can get a plunging attack in. Although I don't really want to plunge down there because I don't remember if there's anybody, any other enemies around here. Feels like there should be, right? Oh. Still, we had stamina left after that attack, which is quite nice. We should not have... Yeah, that was not... Uh, that was luck. Oh, nice. We made plunging attack here. It does cost us some health, but honestly, that's easier than deal dealing with them. Uh, I was sure there were two of them. I guess I'm wrong? Man, we have so many souls. 
Is there an ambush down here? I don't remember there being an ambush. Oh, there is sort of an ambush. I thought... Hmm. We'll be careful, I suppose. We will be very, very careful. Yeah, it's just the one. Interesting. Ugh. Yeah, you're not frustrating at all. You know... Okay, there we go. Okay. So far, so good. And I skipped a bunch of items over here, so we should probably go pick those up. Man, I don't want to go for the boss. Ah, uh, plus we have 52,000 souls. This is always the dilemma, isn't it? I suppose we can ra run straight for the boss at this point. Um, that is, if I am remembering this area correctly. Uh, okay, well, we do need to rest, and we should spend these souls, because we have a lot. Which pains me to do, but... I don't have great confidence that we can um, defeat the boss in one go. Um... I don't even remember how to defeat the boss, so, you know, there's that. Hey. Yeah, I don't know why I came here. We're, no, we're not going to get a boss in this episode by coming here. Oh, wait, unless... Technically, sorry, I... Yeah, here we go. It's a tough one. Uh, we were going for strength, right? Yeah. Oh, wow, that was... Farewell, Ashen One. Mayst thou thy peace discover. Interesting. I hadn't listened to that before, but that is different. We haven't picked up anything... Yeah, nothing, nothing useful. Although at this point in the game, we have a plus seven SS shard. I think you can get to plus ten in one, in one go around. Um, but again, I... You know, every time I've done that, you must have, you know, yeah, every time I've done that has been an interesting adventure. Okay. Oh my goodness, we forgot an item. Well, that's frustrating. <laughs> now we have to do all of, the oh man. That's what you should really have been yelling at me about. Okay. Okay. I guess we could fight this guy down here. Um, we could also try sneak up, sneaking up. Oh wait, we can't sneak up on him. Oh, uh, no, we can go around the, we can go around the side again. Sneaking never makes any sense to me in this game. Um, although, we could try sneaking and just getting the item. I kind of just want the item. Yeah, I don't really want to fight him again. He seems content to just stare off into the distance, so we will let him do that. Okay, we have 10,000 souls, which is a lot, but it's also only a quarter of a level at this point. Um, and, yeah. Now we just have, you know... A slight problem. Very slight problem, you know. Not a... Not a huge thing we should be, uh... Not a, not a great thing to be dealing with right now. On the plus side, he, uh, he does take care of these guys for us. As long as we wait long enough. Okay. Excellent, excellent. Okay. We just need to be a little quick on our feet. Ha! 
Ha oh boy. Oh dear. Okay, so part of me Ow, that's not fair at all. Okay, part of me wants to deal with that guy, part of me kinda doesn't care. I'm pretty sure we can come back here and like deal with stuff after beating the boss, so we will we will operate under that assumption. Where did you come from? Ah, oh boy, why are there two of you? Where's all my stamina? Why are there three of you? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I have made many errors. Oh, one of them died. I'm okay with that. Hopefully that wasn't just because the uh, wyvern was nearby. So the trick is, we need to clear out all of these guys, and once we do, we're kind of in the clear. Um, unfortunately, there are a lot of them. Many. Many of them. Uh, yeah, there we go. Just, uh, duck down here for a second. See, this is an interesting boss fight. Like, you're not actually fighting the boss most of the time. This this is probably the most demons souls of the bosses in uh in Dark Souls 3. Okay. Come on. Nice, nice. Just need to gain our stamina back and excellent, excellent. Things are going pretty well, I'd say. Now all we have to worry about is walking into a trap. I would love to not die from the wyvern. I don't think he fights up here, but I also don't want to find out that I'm wrong. Okay. Things are going incredibly well so far. But again, um... Oh, lightning arrows. That's almost tempting. That is almost tempting. Okay. So far so good, so far so good. Again, I don't really remember how to fight this boss. I do remember that what we're doing is the correct thing. I just don't remember what comes after it. And I'm really trying to clear out all of the enemies because I don't want to deal with them later. We seem to be okay. The only real trick are those enemies across the bridge there. Um, I guess we could jump down here. and don't think... Oh, of course it does. Does damage. Uh, yeah, that's the real problem there. Ugh, and their stupid curving fireballs. Stupid curving fireballs. Okay. All we need to do is to get this big guy to fight us in a place where that fireball will not hit us. As long as we can do that, things will be acceptable. Oh my goodness. Look at that. <laughs> Ow. Ugh. Ow. Okay. Yeah, this actually isn't so bad. Oh, I have no idea what that attack was, and I do not want to find out. We are... Well, I was going to say we were in a pretty good position there, because we were... Um, oh, no. Oh no, we are so dead. Oh, we are so dead. <sighs> I gotta say, <laughs> there's... I think I've complained about this before, not in this Let's Play, but in general. Um, there are just a few too many um, occasions where, like, one thing will kill you. Like, uh, one hit will kill you. Unless you're at full... Unless you're at full HP, yada yada yada. Um... 
Um. Ow. Ow. Okay. Running would be good now. Running would be quite excellent. Ow. Okay, we just need to survive. We just need to survive, right? Just need to survive. Just survive, please. Ow. Please. No. Please no. You know, running towards the dragon fire seems like the optimal move here. Okay. Well, that could have gone a little better. Okay. I'll take that. I mean, I won't, or I don't like it because we used two Estus there, but, um, only so much you can do, I suppose. The real pain and a half is that we have to fight all of these things again. And I really don't want to fight these things again. We should be able to stand here. Uh, I hope we aren't being attacked. I'm sure we're fine. I'm sure everything's fine. Everything's fine and dandy. Okay, well, it's not coming after us, so we're going to go this way. Well, that went well. Yep, uh, this is going just about as well as I was expecting. Ugh. Weirdly, though, like, this section of the game just doesn't feel nearly as as frustrating as Champion Gundir. Possibly because you're fighting so many different things. Um, and, like, you do have a chance to fight back. It's just not... Great. <laughs> I don't know. It's a tough one. Okay. Things are going acceptably. Now there is a large guy up there, but uh, do we want to fight them again? I don't really want to fight them again. Did we attract the attention of that one? We did. Excellent. Fighting them one-on-one -on -one is always preferable, obviously. If we could just get you to come around the corner, that would be great. Can you just walk a little further? Just a tad bit further. No rush. No rush. Okay, if you could just walk around that corner, please. Okay, walk forward. Excellent, excellent. Just a little bit further down these steps if you could. No, no, please come forward. Thank you. Thank you. You have been most gracious, although it took you forever to follow my instructions, so points off for that. You will not be getting a five-star rating. I don't know what I'm talking about. We were mostly safe up here, right? You know, except for the fire-breathing, axe-wielding uh, thing. Oh, that was a mistake on my part. What is this, anyway? Because I have no idea. <clears throat> okay. We will not jump down, even though it is tempting to do so. Since we want to preserve as much health as we possibly can. Which is unfortunate, but what can you do? Okay, we have attracted both of their, both of their attentions. And now we just need to wait for it to walk across the bridge. Which is not going to take forever at all. 
Stupid curving fireballs. Stupid curving fireballs. What are you doing? Why are you walking that way? I wonder, can we get it to hit it? That would be fantastic. No, we cannot. Ugh, why are you standing there? No! Ah, oh boy. This is... inconvenient. Quite inconvenient. This is not how I wanted to do uh, approach this. Uh, however, it is how we will approach this. Please climb up. Ow. No problems. No problems at all. Do they climb stairs? I don't think they do. Okay. Well, unfortunately, we will need to deal with them the next time we come down here. Um... Is it this way? I think it's this way. I could be wrong about that. I'm pretty sure I'm wrong about that. Uh, yeah, I'm wrong about that. It's actually this way. So now, all we need to do is not fail. Oh, no. I was lining us up, and then I was like, oh, I should just go for it. And then I was, then the other half of my brain that was keeping track of the dragon was like what do you think what are you doing what are you doing okay well i was at least wrong that we wouldn't be fighting a boss in this episode but now the episode is just going to turn into fighting this boss ah uh, ah well can't have everything i suppose so we did very poorly getting through this first section uh when we went through before we definitely need to get behind his I mean, ideally, oh, like what hit us there? Okay, I think we did a little better that time. Now we just need to stand here and get him to breathe fire. And we will actually run across here uh, to get them as centered as possible. Well, that went poorly. I... Don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Ah. <sighs> Quite frustrating. I mean, it's, it's fine that you're not dying. It really is. I just want some consistency. Oh my goodness. Uh, don't suppose I could convince you to... Yeah, just stand right there. No, no. Back up a little, please. Well, I'm almost tempted to just uh, let myself die at this point. <laughs> Okay, we already know that we can ignore that guy because... Mostly ignore that guy. <laughs> oh, that's frustrating. Seriously. So why did we get parried twice in that fight? Like, we haven't been parried before. I'm not sure we have enough uh, Estes left. Okay. I'm not going to bother fighting the big guy on top of the roof here, uh, because it just doesn't seem like it matters. Okay, admittedly that one was my fault. Uh, kind of. I mean, I kind of guessed that that was going to be a parry, but... Ah, annoying. Very annoying. Our real question is... Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, uh, why? 
Okay, I would like... I would like to get rid of this guy. Okay, then. Oh, no. You know, some days... Some days are better than other days. Yes. Okay. Well, that is at least some of them that we don't need to worry about right now. And it only took half our Estus to get here. Okay. Oh. Wait, we only needed to do that once? What? I was certain you needed to do that multiple times. I Like, I was... I was 95% sure you had to do that, like, three or four times. Oh, this is different. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I just want a bonfire. No. I guess if we die, it's fine. We beat the boss. That's the important part. Where is this taking us? I actually have no idea. Oh. 77,000 souls. That's like a whole level at this point. Oh, yes, yes. Let us let us not go into that room. That room is a silly place. One which I am not a happy fan of, uh, not a big fan of. Oh, boy. Plus, we have a bunch of items that we now need to go get. Now that the dragon will no longer be bothering us. Why am I doing this with 139,000 souls? Because I'm... an idiot, I guess? That's like two levels. Okay. There are a lot of items that we have missed, though. And now we can proceed cautiously for a change. And I do like proceeding cautiously. Oh. I don't know if I've ever read that before. I mean, I must have, right? I definitely thought you had to do that two or three times before, at least, before, uh, before the dragon died. But I guess you only have to do it once. Ugh. Dark Souls, why do you do this? Why? You know, the Ring of Steel Protection, admittedly, is a tempting choice. I remember having one ring that I thought we didn't particularly need. Um, oh yes, the Covetous Silver Serpent Ring. It's useful, though. Um, let's see, what does the, uh, what does that one do? What is the, uh, oh boy. Physical damage absorption. It is tempting. It's tempting. Oh, actually, that's also tempting. You know what? Um... Interesting. Uh, is this the one? Okay, so it stays in our inventory. Interesting. I guess we'll keep it on. I guess. It doesn't seem to increase our... I should have checked that, actually. Um, yeah, so we still have it. 57.5 uh, to 60.4. And where do we check our stamina? So our stamina is currently 140. Yeah, that's that's pretty that's that's worth it, I think. Okay. Honestly, do not remember where all the items are around here. Uh since obviously you're distracted while first exploring this area. If we can just do this carefully, cautiously, slowly. Okay, so clearly we need to dodge, unfortunately. Ugh. You know, every game has, has this enemy, and this game has multiple versions of this enemy. And I gotta say, not a fan. Not a fan. Because you just have to wait until they, uh, until they attack, and then you can do something. Ah, this feels... 
Oh, it's quiet over here. Interesting. There are items all over this place. Ooh, a lightning urn. I think we already... Yeah, I think we already got one. But we definitely needed one to uh, trade. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Well, that was unpleasant. That was quite unpleasant. Well then. Admittedly, in Dark Souls, uh, that would probably have been our death, since it had a tendency to trap you in... trap you in a, uh, location, and then just kind of wail on you until you died. Although two is not usually enough. It's usually three enemies that do that to you. They are just handing out Titanite chunks all over the place. Uh, this feels like a trap. Huh, ah, nice. I guess it wasn't a trap. Okay. Uh, man, I don't want to go through all of this again. We just did all of this. And then they teleported us away. Not very nice of them, you know? Ugh. That's just... That is just mean. Oh well. At least we have plenty of souls. Not terribly necessary. But... Then again, it does feel kind of good to, uh... Deal with them. Oh my goodness, I saw it, and I was pressing the shield button, and I just... <sighs> okay. I don't know, some part of this is probably because I'm just not used to... Uh, not used to this area. Okay. So unfortunately, uh, we do need to... Um, Oh, my goodness. <laughs> like, what? What? Why? Why does why does that happen? In Dark Souls, there's a, uh, there's a knight that you fight. And that particular, and that knight, um, goes into a parrying stance. And it's very obvious. And it's, it's, it's something you have to deal with. Because, you know, he does a ton of damage and almost kills you if you, if you don't pay attention to that. But these guys, like, they're just kind of blobs, which admittedly is not the easiest thing to, um, to, uh, telegraph attacks with. And I gotta admit, I don't like it. I guess it wouldn't be so... Okay, that was my fault. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Why is this guy so much more difficult today? I say today, I mean this life. Okay then. Yeah, this guy is uh, doing quite a bit more damage to us than I took before. Maybe we just got lucky? Oh, that is very far. Oh! Okay. Oh, interesting. I expected that to kill him, not, uh... 161,000 souls. Oh, dear. Um, I think that's most everything, isn't it? There might have been... Were there any... Yeah, there's an item up there. I can see it. Oh, and there's a door, too. Hopefully, with any bit of luck, this guy will come after us this time. I'm keeping the shield up just in case there's some weird randomness to this. Uh, okay, so we're going to try to get him to come after us by jumping up there. for Excellent, excellent. There we go. Oh, boy. That is... That is too much... That is, that is too much range. That is too much range. 
Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. See, this is what this is the uh, this is about how well uh, this goes usually. I wonder if fighting this guy in a confined space is better or worse. Also, I do not feel like that attack should have hit us. <laughs> I feel like of all the attacks that uh, we've had um, that have bounced off of walls in various locations, that one in particular should not have hit us. Ugh. I'm disgusted with myself. Also, so much damage. Okay, I would like to hide, but I don't think we can. Oh, please. Okay. <laughs> it's like I have as I have as much health I had as much health in my health bar as we did at the beginning of the game, and I was still worried that he would kill us in one hit. Makes you really respect those soul level one runs, you know? Okay. It's just the one guy, right? Okay. Yeah, the four hits is quite frustrating. Four hits, I don't know what it is about four hits, but it just makes things infinitely more difficult. Also, I am a complete and utter idiot. I've just noticed where that door takes us. Oh well. I guess we had to pick up all the items on the way anyway. Am I missing something? Where, where was that item? Oh, it's up there. Uh, I don't know that we can get there. Well, I feel silly now. Uh, ah, but there's an item over there. Excellent. And we have made our way through bit by bit. 170,000 souls. We were probably going to get three levels out of this. That's pretty nice, got to admit. And we can probably, uh, yeah, yeah, no, no, I don't, I don't think so. Um, and we can probably level up our shield, finally. Is there anything about down here? Uh, how do we get down? Oh boy! Oh, that should not have, that should not have hurt us. Well, I hope this goes somewhere. <laughs> oh boy! Um. Okay. Well then, I think we will be teleporting back up to the top there. Well, I don't remember what this does, but I do remember it does something. And given how little uh, Estus we have left, I'm going to prepare for the worst. Um, yeah, I remember this doing something, I just don't remember what. Or not, or not, I was sure that you had to ring this bell. I guess I'm wrong. Maybe it's a different bell. I, I, that could be. Yeah, in any event, Shrine Bonfire. And we're going to go do all the things. We could go get that uh, armor as well. But no, we've already chosen our armor for the uh, for the playthrough. Uh, we want our shield, which of course we don't have enough. We don't have enough Titanite for. Ah, oh, well. Okay. Well, oh, wait, can we upgrade our normal weapon? We can. That's amazing. Oh man, we might be able to get to... Yes, we can get to plus 10. Excellent. Uh, while we're here, um, let's see here. Black Blade, as long as they take tit lar tit and Titanite or Large Titanite. And... K uh, oh, hmm. Oh, it does have really good scaling. I hadn't noticed that before. I mean, it still takes your health, so it's it's no good. But we will we will see what we can see with the uh, with the black blade. Yeah, I think we have enough large titanite for that. That's tempting, admittedly. 
We could just buy all of these. <laughs> no, it's fine. Um, we don't really want anything from Carla. And uh, he's definitely dead. I don't know where, but he's definitely dead. Uh, is there any cool armor we want to buy? Oh, we can give him, give her Umber Lash. Let us see here. Ring of Sacrifice. Um, that doesn't seem particularly useful to me. I'm just saying. Uh, let's see. Could get could get some armor sets. Xanthus Overcoat. Gundir. Ah, Gundir. Yeah, no, I don't think so. I don't like him. Although Carla's equipment is kind of tempting, because that's what we were doing in the last game, I think. Our Demon Souls, rather. Uh, Executioner. Exile. Smoth. Uh, Dancer, ah, oh, Dancers is kind of nice. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll pick that up too. This is a tremendous waste of souls, by the way. Um, Leggings of Favor, so that guy. Uh, Elite Knight, yeah, I think we're, I think we're good. The rest of this can, actually, let's go make sure that, man, we just spent like 40,000 souls on items. That is, that is painful. Can we get anything cool? Uh, did we get anything cool? I don't think we... Did we get a soul from that? Did we not... Oh... Well, I'll have to look at the recording to see what he just said, because I am curious. Uh, can... I don't think we got a soul for... Oh, we got a bunch of souls. Um, I'm selling these, and it's an absolutely terrible idea, because this is not going to get us enough for a level. It's fine. Oh, actually, what we can do... <laughs> sell all of those... Uh, probably don't need any rubbish. Might as well, might as well keep one on hand just in case, you know. Just in case, I guess. And finally, okay, so we want to get to 18 strength and two levels of endurance. Wow. Okay, so that was perfect. That's interesting. I did not realize she changed what she said after giving her the eyes. Fascinating. Still don't have anything cool there, so let's head back to the Dragonkin Mausoleum, and we will start from there next time. Thank you for watching.